Hello everyone and welcome to Opportunity Circle, the number one opportunities discovering platform for youth. In this video, we are going to give you details about a highly competitive and a fully funded internship opportunity in South Korea, the Global Intern Program 2021. This is a fully funded program in South Korea. The Global Intern Program in South Korea 2021 will be held at the Gwangju Institute of Science and Technology. The duration of the Gwangju International Science and Technology Internship 2021 program is 8 weeks. There is no application fee and applicants can apply without IELTS or TOEFL. This is a highly competitive and a fully funded internship opportunity. In this program, all interns will be able to cultivate innovation in technology and science through this global internship program, students would collaborate education with research and learn in a better way. Gwangju Institute of Science and Technology is a research-oriented institute that focuses on innovative research models and creative economic entrepreneur training. During the summers, all selected students will learn how to take research initiatives with the help of renowned professors. All senior year students of an undergraduate program or master's enrolled students can apply for this global internship program in Korea 2021. While on the internship, half of the airfare will be provided, health insurance, accommodation and culture exploration will be included. Furthermore, we move forward towards the eligibility criteria of the global internship program. All international students can apply for this internship program in South Korea. A candidate must be either a final year student of an undergraduate degree program or a master's enrolled student. Candidate must have a GPA of 3.0 or above. Candidate must be in good well-being. The benefits of the South Korea Global Internship Program 2021 Stipend, Special Lectures, Health Insurance, Culture Exploration, Korean Culture Class, Accommodation, Half Coverage of Airfare, and Korean language class for all interns. Documents required to apply for the South Korea Internship Program 2021 Scanned Original Degree Certificates Scanned Original Transcript Letter of Recommendation and an English Language Test The application deadline for this internship program is 12 March 2021. Moving forward towards the application process Applications can be found online on the official portal with a complete application guide for filling the online internship application. A candidate needs to create an account in order to apply. The candidate needs to then fill in the online application form along with the required documents. To view the complete application guide, click on this link on our website. After clicking on the link, you will be redirected to the official application guide. Here you can see there are different steps mentioned in this website. 1.1 applying to GIST. Point one, before applying, please review all instructions carefully before completing the application. Incorrect or incomplete information may prevent your application from being considered. 1.2, application procedure. Step one, apply for a place in your desired program. Decide on the specific laboratory you wish to study and complete the application form. Complete all relevant sections of the online application form. The global program is designed to provide knowledge and experience in the following areas. School of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science, School of Material Science and Engineering, School of Mechanical Engineering, School of Earth Science and Environmental Engineering, School of Life Sciences, Department of Physics and Photon Science, Department of Chemistry, Department of Biomedical Science and Engineering, School of Integrated Technology. List of required application documents, submission of the online application form, original official degree certificates, original official transcripts for all undergraduate and graduate, one letter of recommendation. A certificate of English language issued by your home university or an official score report of the TOEFL, IELTS, TOEIC or TEPS. Step 2. Wait for the results. Step 3. Enrollment. And step 4. Apply for the visa. So number 2. Login or apply. Registering your online application. This is the written description of the application process. You can give it a read and we will show you the application process further in the video. In the application process section, press on the apply now link. Are you enjoying the video? Do press the like button below and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for daily updates and latest content. Also join on our Telegram to get daily opportunities directly during to be redirected to the official page of the GIST Global Intern Program 2021. A brief application guide is also given on the website. Click on the online application button. After pressing the online application button, your application will start. 
enter your email and a password and click on apply if you're applying for the first time or click on login if you've applied before so this is the foreign applicants registration pop-up you have to add in your surname your given name if you have a middle name which is not mandatory your date of birth gender telephone your nationality zip code correspondence address these are pre-filled terms the recruit year proposed date of entrance extended degree program department to which you wish to apply from this drop down list you can select the department in which you wish to apply proposed laboratory in your favorite department at gist or desired academic advisor department to which you want to apply this is the second and then you have to select the laboratory how interested are you in applying to gist for your masters or phd Click on very interested, somewhat interested, not interested according to your preference, your email address, password and then you have to click on the personal information collection and usage agreement. You have to tick this. You can read the privacy policy. This is the privacy policy. Click on check after reading it and then click on save to save your application and move to the next step. After saving the previous page, you will see a page like this. This page will contain all your applications on your email address. By clicking on this new apply button, you can start a new application. And here is your previous information. Here you have to add in your picture. It should be a colored picture. Any information that is left. Your final, final university graduation or your current university. Subject of graduation thesis. To submit the required document. Please click the attachment button. You have to uh, attach your documents over here. Next is the language section. In this section, you have to tell your Korean language proficiency. Is English the language of instruction at your home institution? Yes or no? Is English your native language? Yes or no? If no, what is your native language? And how do you come to know about GIST? From this drop down list, you have to select from internet, from GIST students, from my advisor, academic society, brochure or poster that GIST sent, or others. The next is the recommendation section. Please submit the names of those providing letters of recommendation. Referee 1. Name of the person who is providing the reference letter for you. University. Position in email. Referee number 2. Name. Position. University. Email. Next is the education section. In this section, you have to add in your university, your degrees. By clicking on new, here you have to put in your degree, academic advisor, subject of graduation thesis, your division, class, standing and standing taught. Degree verification information. You will take full responsibility for the accuracy of the documentations that you provide. You have to take this. In the event that any academic information that you submitted is found to be fake or to contain inaccurate statements, your admission to GIST will be cancelled. Institution. Complete name including any former names, student ID number, date of confirmation, and degree title. University Registrar's information. Name, email address, mailing address, official title, and office phone number. English certificates. Click on new and add in the certificate, the test that you have taken, test score and the date when the test was given. Next is the study plan and self introduction section. In this section, firstly you have to give information about the knowledge of major field, reason for study in Korea, key achievements, goal of study and study plan, action plan after study and your self introduction. And then after giving all this information, you have to click on submission. Further changes cannot be made after clicking the submit button. So make sure that all the information that you enter is correct and nothing can be changed after the submission. Thank you for watching this video. We hope that this video is helpful for you and we'll be back with more videos.